Hey guys, Solano here from PlayToEarn.net. Welcome to the final part of our weekly blockchain gaming news roundup. In this video, we'll be diving into the big stories that made headlines in the world of blockchain gaming this past week. So far, we've covered all the latest game updates and exciting teasers and announcements. And now it's time to take a look at the news that don't quite fit in those two categories. So without further ado, let's get started. To start off our list, Yield Guild Games secures $13.8 million in token sale backed by DWF Labs and A16Z Crypto. Yield Guild Games, or YGG, a leading blockchain gaming guild, has completed a $13.8 million token sale led by DWF Labs, with participation from A16Z Crypto, Galaxy Interactive, Sanghai Capital Fund, Sanctuary Capital, and angel investor David Lee. For those who may not know, YGG is a player in gaming guild that allows players to rent in-game NFT assets and participate in blockchain-based economies. It is best known for its partnership with the popular NFT game Axie Infinity. YGG will use the fresh funds to develop its soulbound token reputation technology, which rewards players and creators with SBTs for completing certain tasks or quests. The reputation tokens were tested last year and were offered as rewards for in-game activities. With the company launching a revamped version of its web app in March, the SBT is set to play a major role in the guild's ecosystem. Dizon told Tech in Asia that SBT tokens are digital assets permanently linked to a person's wallet, making them non-transferable. The company also stated that there are plans in place to integrate these tokens into games. YGG did not disclose the number of tokens sold during the latest fundraising. However, the sale looks expected to have accounted for over 35% of its estimated total asset value of $25 million in its treasury as of November 2022. Even so, YGG still controls a 45% reserve of the firm's max token supply, according to Dizon. Last March, YGG partnered with 4 to launch its Japan-based subdao YGG Japan. This followed the launch of the company's first subdao YGG Southeast Asia in January 2022. Home next, new YouTube CEO picks special interest in metaverse and NFTs. Neil Mohan has been appointed as the new CEO of YouTube, a Google-owned streaming platform, after serving as a chief product officer for seven years. The role was formerly occupied by Susan Wajiki, a Polish-American who stepped down to start a new chapter focused on her family, health, and other passionate projects. Prior to his appointment, Mohan has shown significant interest in integrating NFTs in the metaverse into the platform. During Wojciki's resignation post, she acknowledged Mohan for his insightful contribution to the launch of YouTube TV and YouTube Music. She highlighted his comprehensive knowledge of the product, business, creator, and user communities as well as employees. She referred to him as a terrific leader, while expressing her admiration for YouTube's incredible leadership team. Mohan believes blockchain and NFTs can facilitate creators in forming stronger bonds with their followers and foster a novel form of collaboration. His desire is to embrace the transformative phase of the internet and its various platforms. Though the word metaverse was introduced first in 1992, the technology has remained in its bud stage. A few developments include some notable platforms like the Sandbox and Decentraland, which have already utilized blockchain to establish ownership of virtual property and other digital assets. In addition to this, Google plans to increase its focus on Web3 solutions by launching Blockchain Node Engine. The cloud-based service is strictly designed for Ethereum developers and projects ensuring reliability, performance, and security in the digital assets industry. Google plans to extend this service to Solana Blockchain by Q1 2023. In recent times, many YouTube staff members have shown strong interest in Web3, including Ryan Wyatt, YouTube's former global head of gaming who took on the role of CEO at Polygon Studios. Mohan's keen interest in Metaverse and NFTs will help content creators enrich their content. If you're liking this news list so far, remember to check out our website and news section to be updated on everything about blockchain gaming. You can also subscribe to our channel to make sure you stay updated on all our videos. Now let's get back to the list. Oh, next, Toei Animation enters the Sandbox Metaverse. Sandbox and Minto Inc. has announced it will partner with Toei Animation to create IP-based experiences in the Sandbox Metaverse. Toei Animation is a leading and pioneer Japanese animation industry that has produced some of the country's best animation productions, such as Dragon Ball, One Piece, and Sailor Moon. Leveraging on the company's experience, Sandbox is confident it will unveil Toy Animation's view through land while pushing Japan-based IP brands to the world. The managing director of Toy Animation Co. Ltd., Satoshi Shinohara, said, quote, Metaverse is a concept that has emerged in recent years. Toy Animation is now ready to set sail into this new ocean. We are very happy and proud to be working with the Sandbox and Minto as our partners. I am confident that the fleet we have assembled will be able to discover new continents and new routes that will guide the entertainment industry for years to come, end quote. He added, quote, I am truly looking forward to seeing the adventures and stories of the various works and characters we have created so far in this new field, end quote. To celebrate this partnership, the Sandbox is giving the 1,000 registered users a limited edition NFT which will be revealed shortly. Users should visit the page to participate in this offer and fill in their email addresses in the appropriate area. They will click on the register button to finish the application. To get the NFT, interested participants must be among the first 1,000 users and have a TSB account and wallet linked to it. They must also have verified their TSB account using the KYC. Oh, um, next, Web3 platform Nefta raises $5 million in seed round led by Play Ventures. Nefta, a Web3 infrastructure provider focused on the gaming and entertainment sectors, has secured $5 million in seed funding. 
The round was led by Play Ventures, a gaming-focused VC firm, with participation from 7X Ventures, Surfmeon, MZ, Polygon Ventures, and reinvestment from Pika's Capital. Play Ventures has invested $2.5 million, the single largest investment from its future fund. Founded by Gishan Willink, Nefta is a blockchain technology platform that provides tools for businesses to launch and grow their Web3 products. These tools include custom APIs, software development kits, and white-label services to help companies to integrate their digital assets, multi-chain wallets, and dedicated marketplaces. Armed with a bigger war chest, the firm intends to expand its operations across the gaming, Web3, and ad tech industries. Willink also told the blog that the company is now valued at $32.5 million, a 225% jump in its valuation over the last 8 months. Nefta was valued at $10 million in June 2022 when it received $1 million in PC funding from Pico's Capital. It should be noted that Nefta did not officially raise the seed round. 7X Ventures, on the other hand, was the first to approach the firm. That conversation went so well that we received a term sheet to follow in our seed round. Following this, we received a lead term sheet from Play Ventures, said Willink. Nefta then met with additional investors before closing the round in January. According to Willink, the seed round brings Nefta's total funding to $6 million. Ken Rickdridge Conningen, general partner at Play Ventures, will join the Nefta board as part of the agreement. The Web3 Engine platform has partnered with blockchain gaming studios like Moon Gaming, Viker, and GAMI, with more to come in 2023. And lastly, Axie Infinity's former esports head joins Crypto Unicorns as product lead. Former Axie Infinity esports director Andrew Zayori Campbell has been named the product and market growth lead at Laguna Games, the creators of Crypto Unicorns. In his new role at Laguna, Campbell will help expand the studio's lineup, including additional games that utilizes NFT unicorn pets, creating a multiverse of crypto unicorns experiences. According to Campbell, he has been a fan of the game since his first NFT drop in 2021. Laguna's flagship product, Crypto Unicorns, has an art style and lightheartedness I can get behind. The unicorns are unique and identifiable, yet wholesome and appealing to a wide variety of gamers, said Campbell in a tweet. The charismatic esports proponent also pointed out that a game's first approach, dedication to transparency, and an active DAO community are the reasons why he joined Laguna. Laguna is curious about cracking the code on community-driven game development. Their RBW governance token has already seen 17 proposals and funded projects from the treasury. Their proposals have an impressive participation rate of over 40%, said Campbell, adding that the company posts quarterly treasury reports that track all spending and build features proposed by their players. Crypto Unicorns is a digital farming and unicorn breeding game built on the Polygon blockchain. The play to earn ecosystem revolves around adorable visuals and various single and multiplayer gameplay that keeps players engaged for hours. Over the next few months, the game will expand beyond the farm and land gameplay, introducing new experiences like jousting, team RPG, unicorn party, and tribes. PvP will also be a huge addition to the worlds of crypto unicorns. According to Campbell, Crypto Unicorns has created a great foundation for its universe with a captivating land gameplay experience. This, however, is only the first step towards creating a fun blockchain game. In order to appeal to a broader audience, the team is looking to incorporate new types of gameplay, allowing players to embark on exciting adventures with their unicorns in the coming months. And that's a wrap for this week's news recap about blockchain gaming. I hope these videos provided valuable insights and updates on the latest happenings in the scene. Thank you for tuning in, and I look forward to keeping you updated with the newest and most impactful developments in blockchain gaming. For more info and everything about blockchain games, check out our website at playtoearn.net, where we have the largest database of games that have all the info you need. That's it for today, see you next video.